Hey guys, Ashley here and this video is five ideas for modern day servanthood. So the first idea is to cook a meal for your family or friends and I just want to say thank you so much to Blue Apron. They are sponsoring this video. So Blue Apron is a company that delivers all the farm fresh ingredients you need right to your doorstep in exactly the right proportions. Um, so no trips to the grocery store, they just deliver it right to your home and there are amazing recipes that you can choose from and what's cool is that this really helped me for serving because I made this meal for my mom and I think that one way we can serve, especially the people in our family, is by cooking a nice meal for them because you can have good fellowship when you cook a meal and then serve it at a table with family or friends or a small group or anyone really in your life that you just want to cook a meal for and just share the love and I think that when you do this especially me doing this for my mom my mom usually does this for me so me being able to do this for my mom was really great and an awesome way to serve her so Blue Apron actually sent two recipes because I got the two recipe box and there's actually another box that you can get which is the family plan which comes with two to four recipes but I just got the two recipes and I'm actually making the chicken and gnocchi pan and I must say it tasted amazing. It was super easy to cook because all the directions came on one sheet and taught me exactly what I needed to do right there. So then I just served this up and it was so simple, it was so easy. Check out the link in the description box. First 50 people to sign up will get $50 off your first two weeks of Blue Apron. And here's a bonus tip for servanthood. It's your time. Now, time is something that when you use it on somebody else, it's something you can never get back. So in my opinion, time is the best thing you can give somebody. You can always get money back. You can earn money. But time is something you can't earn back, and that's why it's the best thing to give to people. So the next tip is when you see a need, meet it without being asked. For example, when you're at home and you see the dish rack filled to the top, don't just ignore it. Get your butt off the couch, off your phone, and start cleaning the dishes or doing the task that you see that needs to be done. And especially if you do this without being asked, you are serving that other person by taking your time to do something for them. So the next tip is to surprise a friend with coffee or any treat they love. And I love this because spontaneous, spontaneously serving somebody else is so fun and surprising someone is so fun. My mom loves coffee and that's where I got my love for, of coffee. And so what I did is I just bought her a Starbucks drink because who don't like Starbucks? And then I just surprised her with it one day and I was able to serve her. So my next tip is to write a letter or a note to whoever God puts on your heart. Now I know for me, I just know when I'm supposed to write somebody a letter. Like I'll meet that person and I'll be like, that's the person God wants me to write letters to. And I love writing letters because they're so uncommon um, today. And so in this video footage, I'm writing a letter to two girls I met on the missions trip I went on who just I had such a sweet connection with and I just wanted to keep encouraging them throughout the year. So I would really encourage you guys to write notes or letters of encouragement to people. Paul did this. He wrote letters to a bunch of people in the Bible. So we know it's a biblical thing and it's a great way to serve someone. 
my last tip is to cover the people in your life with prayer. And I actually think this is the best way that you can serve and love somebody else is through praying for them. Because you're taking time out of your day, you're taking your eyes off of yourself, and you're really just focusing on praying for the other person. I actually want to leave you guys today with this Bible verse which says, Be devoted to one another in love. Honor one another above yourselves. And this is what this video is all about. It's about loving each other by thinking of others as better than yourself. So just remember that as you go on today and in your life serving others and just look to Jesus as your example. And I just pray that you guys would be good at serving others so that more people will come to know Christ. I'm gonna give you a little bit for the video, okay? Probably ate McDonald's on the way here. I did not, goof nut. I ate Burger King. There's a big difference. Burger King's straw broiled. <laughs>